Dual 2 is the only game you go back to? Wow. See, I would go back to Remastered in probably 3. Um, I've already sort of shared my sentiment on my feelings on this game long ago. Um, it's just not my cup of tea, really. If at all. But I don't even know if that was the end of the game. <laughs> Drink up, silly. Um, it's the weapon and spell variety and whatnot. Okay. It's not. Thank God. Okay. <laughs> I was going to say, it might be a little on the easy side for, for some people. But, oh, doesn't this guy look like a, a fun part? That was a game that you forced you to sort of... Uh, it's, it's weird how people... I, I, I mean, everyone has opinions and everything, right? But it's, it's weird how those are the two games that people differ on. Now, I have a question to ask. If this is the final boss, do I have to still... If I die, which I will, do I have to keep fighting the Defender and the Watcher? Now, oh, this guy looks like it's going to be a fun fight. Absolutely. Nah? Okay, so that's good. So at least I've defeated this thing. Oh god, what are you doing? Oh. Oh, interesting. What are these things that you're making? Oh, okay. You have a laser. Great. Oh, don't get near those things. Okay, those are going to curse you. That's going to curse you. Alright, so stay away from curses. Oh. Oh, okay. Yep, that hurt. Thank you for that. Oh, God. Okay. Ow. Oh, yep, that hurt. That hurt a lot. Oh, God! I stole a fun, fun boy for fun. See, I keep, I, I keep doing that stupid thing. I, I don't know why I'm running out of um, stamina so quickly, but uh, and maybe I'm just being stupid. But I'm running up to things, and I'm, you know, I'm hitting it four times. Oh great! Oh great! Cursed. This okay. This is gonna this gonna go over well. I also like his little gimmick, like the curse gimmick. And yeah, we all love curse gimmicks, don't we? Ow! Ow please don't touch me. Ooh. Most anticlimactic ending boss. This is actually a lame fight, the DLC. That's what I heard. That's what I heard, but it's... Uh, I, I can't. I can't do it. Couldn't do it. The last thing I want to deal with is, you know... <coughs> um, you know, 10, 12, 14 more hours of this. I'm sorry, but... Zero interest. And that's unfortunate. I'm not going to lie, that's probably unfortunate that I have that feelings on this game. Uh, you vote Fume Knight Best Boss. <coughs> Fume Knight? I don't know idea what that is. But, I will say, like in the first Dark Souls... Um, oh, yeah. Um, like in Dark Souls 1, the fact that um, the final boss is just right there, there's... Um, you know, that was a human, wasn't it, that guy? Kayomi? Yes, it is. Alright, well, you get your ass over here. Just to run up to him was fucking trash. <laughs> Let's go, dude. There you go. Throne of Want. Where's the Throne of Need?
I was hoping to, uh, I mean, uh, maybe I was hoping to finish this uh, early, but at least with this being done, I have a, I have a, a good, a good stretch to grow on into um, uh, Dark Souls 3 with, because we're going to play um, Dragon Soul, Dragon Soul, Dragon Warrior 11, or Dragon Quest as they call it, um, tomorrow, uh, and then Friday is going to be Monster Hunter World, where I'm looking, looking for that. Also, we're going to go, where else we can get this boy in here? Because why the hell not? Because we, we, I don't even care at this point. I don't even care. I'm gonna get cursed. I'm gonna. I, too many things are gonna happen here. Where this is just gonna go really terrible for us all. You can watch this again, you bum. I don't know how to approach the curse in this. I mean, as, as I was gonna say in the first game, the the cursed. And the, the first game was terrible. Like you were cursed, you, you, it was permanent. You, you lost half the health, and until you you know we could take the item and fix it, if you didn't even know what the item was, I think it's some type of stone. Oh, it's terrible, terrible. But pop the bubbles. Oh, just like hit them. I thought when I went up to them, I didn't do anything. But maybe that'll be my job. Maybe that'll be my job. Just run around and while the the NPCs and the and the player character, excuse me, do the work. See, I'm... Oh, okay, so it does work. It does work. Uh, what's with the fire now, man? Oh, it's... Oh, God. This is this is gonna go over well, isn't it? Who's doing this fire stuff? What happened there? Pretty sure it has to be a physical hit and not a roll or magic. Okay, okay, I'll try that. And we're dead. Again. See the thi the w the thing with that in particular is the um like to me here is like when you're getting cursed I understand if that thing's there and it's continuing on and, and blah 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 what I don't get is when it's um it disappears but still you're somehow cursed like okay is is that how this is going to exist is that how that's going to go I don't know I don't know Oh, God, just get me through there, God damn it! But there, you know, like, even Dark Souls 1 at least threw in some enemies uh, at the end when you were approaching this, like, eh, I'm, I'm indifferent to it. Um, you know, although Dark Souls 1 didn't throw in uh, a pre-boss before the actual boss, so maybe that's the equivalent. But you still had to beat those guys in. Curse is basically slowly turning you hollow. And if it's lingering curse, it deals damage. So, like, how do I... How do I go about avoiding that? I guess is the, the easy way. Like, is there an avoidance? Like, okay, even standing near them uh, curses you. Or, and hitting me, apparently. Okay. Kill Vendrick and beat all three DLC kings. What? Like, see, I, I, I can see, like, that part there. I, I Oh, god damn it, you stupid thing. Oh, I also see it's starting to, uh... I see what you're saying. Never... I'm starting to understand what was killing me.
Use the goddamn life gem. Jesus Christ. I was like in her skirt. Yeah, I, I assume it's a her. Oh god. Okay, okay, oh god, okay. So you don't want to get the full curse out, is, is what you don't want. <laughs> and you also just don't want to, um, you also just don't want to roll off the edge there like I did, because I'm just not paying attention. Uh, curse resistant armor, items, stuff like that. Vendrick will bless the crowns, and you won't go hollow, but I'm pretty sure you still take damage. Life gems make. Yes, yes. The fact that I can. I guess eat a life gem and uh, <laughs> just stroll on. But yeah, I would agree with that. I, at first, I was trying to figure like, what, what's their whole deal, right? Like, what's the whole point of the of the life gem? Um, like, as well as SS flasks. And then I was like, okay, well, SS flasks recharge, which is super nice, obviously. Um, but the uh, you know the other end of it was uh, new. You know, you have a few of those old radiant gems, you know, you, you take them a little earlier. So now now I understand how that works, at least. Go up the skirt, you know, get in there, attack it a few times. Don't get cursed overly too much, because then you're going to have to use an effigy in the middle of a fight, and you're screwed. Oh, God. <laughs> yeah. It was just a clip you just made. Oh, that's unfortunate. I'm sorry you got uh, purged out there for a second there. <laughs> but thank you for it. Man, all he gets... Where can I get more effigies from? That's gotta be something out there, right? So do, uh, do these disappear? Oh god. It's not the worst purge. This dude uh, used to say that one. Uh... Oh god. I, I, I don't understand what you're... What is cursing me? Oh, good, they disappear. Fantastic. being stupid here. Get away from the curse. Just get away from it. That's fine. Did we do it? Oh god, I was like running away from everything there. What happens now? <laughs> Proceed to the throne. Oh. Yeah, I'm sorry you got purged there, Larry. Apologize. Steve, Dad, whatever. <laughs> so am I in charge of the lizard people now, or the stone people? Ah, appreciate the follow as well, Larry. Thank you.
they all look like the uh, the giants. Eiferlin, a blowjob an hour keeps a pussy from going. <laughs> How you doing, Eiferlin? How was your holidays there, buddy? If you, you actually had holidays. Who link the fire. Your New Year's, your Christmas, your crazy Kwanzaa, or whatever it is you celebrate, my good friend. Once the fire is linked, souls will flourish anew, and all of this will play out again. It is your choice to embrace. What do you guys say? Or renounce this. Embrace or renounce. They were chill. Just kind of stayed to myself. Good to hear. Good to hear. Sometimes those are a, a, a warm welcome of a of a of a little bit of a break, right? Drank for the first time in a month. Oh, what was the drink that you had? Twiz Chill. Very nice. Very nice to hear. I have a lot of booze and I can't wait for this weekend to sort of really just dive on into Great a few summer. drinks here and there, so. Take your uh, some Johnny Walker Black Label. Might be. Might be. Bunch of shit, mainly old fashions. Very nice. Very nice. What lies ahead, only you can see. What a weird way to tie the belt. You think you'd just cut the end off or something, right? Oh wait, that's it? We're just gonna sit in here and, and wait for the next one to call us? Could you imagine this game was constantly running like I mean, it'd be ridiculous when the game would first come out, but could you imagine that when you play the game and someone got to the end, they had to finally face you, and you get called out, and then if they beat you, they take the throne, and that's your end of the game? So this is the guy. Yui Tanimura. He's the guy that didn't do very good, correctly, I assume. No, not, not El Rome was a, was a great fan of his, I assume. It's unfortunate, but... Or is that the actual guy on as director, but he didn't actually make the game. I can't remember. I know it was all a bunch of stuff. But that's what we run to here, folks. We run to get to the credits of a game. Dark Souls 2, Dark Souls 1 complete. We're gonna finish up the trilogy um, before Sekiro comes out. We got some, uh, some Dragon Quest, Dragon Warrior 11 coming up tomorrow. Monster Hunter on Friday. The real guy is Mizuaki. Yes, thank you. That's I knew the name was was somewhere. So he's number one and number three as well as on Sekiro, I believe. Wait, is he still with From Software? Um, that you guy, or is he um, is he out like completely? They just like, dude, how do you ruin this game? How do you forget that? As I probably throw this game up on, um, I hope not. He probably isn't. He probably isn't, or at least he's probably not in any scope of um, really being at least a director. He might be a producer or something like that. He's swagging right now. I was thinking about it. I was thinking about it. It's two o'clock. I gotta go to work. Um, for five, and I generally. I don't know if I want to take a nap or anything beforehand, and I don't want to jump on into something and get really into it um, and eat up a lot of time. So I'll probably jump into it probably this weekend because I'm off and I'll, I can have a lot of time to, to deal with it. And you know, if I want to sit down for eight hours, I can. Um, I just really don't know maybe what class or whatever I want to roll with. That's really where we're at with that. Or I mean, I guess it's irrelevant what class we start off with, but. I don't know if I want to go like with a similar build. Do we want to go with another Uji Katana? I mean, should we make all three of the Uji Katana run? Maybe I don't know. Um, we've never tried a, a sorcerer or a pyromancy build on on any of these games, um, but yeah, it is what it is. But I'm happy I finished it today. I was, I was sort of, mm, I was like, no, I do not want to jump on into this in, in the end. Uh, I mean, it uh, it has a tutorial type deal. Um, yeah, I probably just wouldn't want to jump on into that right now because um, you know what's the tutorial going to be an hour or so. I could finish that and then what get everyone's uh, appetites whetted and uh, go from there. I think we'll I think we'll try it on the weekend. I mean, I do, I'll be around, so I think I have to go to IKEA to get some lights and something, but 
That's about it, really. Of all things, Ikea. If you have any skill at these games, it's maybe 30 minutes. Well, I don't know. That depends. Did you see me have any skill there at all? I mean, that end boss was not difficult. Um, but that's a weird thing. In, in Of the two Dark Souls games I've played, the last boss is not probably even close to the most difficult boss. But again, it's all about the, it's all about the journey. It's all about the, um, the approach to it as well. Like, I mean, if you can't beat, you know, boss A, B, C, X, Y, Z and can't make it to the end, you're never going to see the ending anyways, right? So that's what it is. But again, what kind of ending was that? We sat on a throne. It was almost like Hollow Knight. Go on your throne, the egg shuts, and you're you're just waiting for the next one. Is that is that what I'm supposed to be waiting for here? Come on, Shelly. But we'll get these up on. Um, I believe I have two rounds of videos to put up on um, on YouTube and, and go from there. Oh, the original Dark Souls 2. Now we're gonna run through all the people who made that one. So is that the guy, Tomohiro Shibuya? He's is he the guy? I even I don't even know. I don't even know. Ah, Gatorade. The drinker's friend. <laughs> Great music though. Um, I, I think maybe, you know, we'll take this opportunity to maybe go over a few of the things that maybe we liked about this game and what we didn't like. <laughs> hey, we already know the controls sucked. I had to use a controller mod to even make it playable. I was so worried about this game of when I first started because I wanted to do, the, you know, play the trilogy of the games. And when I first started this game, I was like, why does everything feel off? Why does it feel like there's like a, a dead stick or something like that? Um, yeah, GG indeed. Um... But uh, it grew on me over time. Uh, the graphics were, were there. I mean, it, you know, it's, nothing was shockingly great or anything like that. But um, you know, it, it did it. Um, music. I, I, I didn't have any complaints. Um, obviously, there's a few boss fights. I had some really good music in some areas. I had some really good music, and then at other points, nothing. Um, but it, it's no Bloodborne. That's for damn sure. I still think. Um, That'll be the big comparison in the end, is, is Dark Souls 3 or Bloodborne? Wh wh which of those two is really going to be the one that we're going to really appreciate the most in the end? So That's what I'm looking forward to with Sekiro, is something that's maybe a mix of a Dark Souls, a mix of a Bloodborne, and a mix of, uh, I don't know, I don't want to say Neo, because I didn't really like Neo. Um, we probably won't even continue on with that anymore. But, ugh, I don't know. I still have Nier Automata going, which I like, but I felt that I was getting a little bit behind on Dark Souls 2. So we sort of put a, a, a kibosh on that currently. And then, you know, like I said, Dragon Warrior, Dragon Quest XI. Depends where you're from, Japanese or whatever. Um, you know, we'll, we'll roll with it. I think uh, Nier Automata is something that I want to roll with. It's been a good enough game for the past couple of years that it's something I want to roll with. But I can't... I don't expect you guys to stick around and sit here and watch the credits with me. I just like to give these people their their proper go. Um, you know, as you know, it gives me a moment to sit there and shoot the shit with you. But uh, I will be back tomorrow, I believe, at 1 p.m. because I'm coming off a night shift um, to play Dragon Quest 11. So if that that interests you, we're starting right over. I'll sort of hit that uh, Japanese RPG that I've been looking forward to playing. Oh, I need a beer. Uh, and if not, this weekend, uh, I will set the times Saturday or Sunday. One of the two. Have an eye on, uh, I believe, that's the Discords. Um, you know, that'll have everything. Or as well as on uh, Twitter, um, which is also that. Um, you can get me there, guys, and figure everything out. And uh, the song is a banger. The song isn't too bad. I'll give it that. Absolutely. The song's pretty good. I think this is something Quad could probably play. I wouldn't be shocked if he couldn't.
Is this where the FBI tells me that I can't play this without making money and blah 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 and they're gonna come to my house even though that the FBI really doesn't exist up here in Canada so they can't come and do anything to me? No. Oh my god, all these technologies from everybody. 2015, the B software, 2008, Google was somehow involved. Havoc, Dolby Digital, Autodesk, everything here. I don't even know what half these things are. And this is where you get into New Game Plus, I guess, right? Just out of nowhere? Who would be starting that garbage up? <laughs> well, that's gonna do it, guys. We finished the game. We're the heir. Achievement unlocked. We're right back at Majula with 90,000 life gems because that's just going to be wonderful. Oh god, that guy just like zoomed right on in me. Uh, that's going to do it for the stream today, guys. If you're interested, tomorrow I'm streaming, like I said, 1 p.m. tomorrow um, with Dragon Quest. So I hope to see you then. It's been a hell of a ride with Dry uh, Dark Souls 2. Dark Souls 3 starting this weekend. All the best, guys. Cheers as always. Thank you for watching. Yes, she is funny sometimes. <laughs> All the best, guys. Cheers.